Hi, Bill here, still here. Yeah, just thought I'd do a little update for you. I had the operation yesterday and uh, all went very well yesterday morning. Um, a bit nauseous when I came round, but, uh, and in the evening I was a bit nauseous too. I was moved on to a ward at uh, eight o'clock in the evening and uh, it was very noisy, but eventually about two o'clock I got to sleep and I got a reasonable night's sleep feeling pretty good and yesterday I was up and about walking up and down drinking lots of water I had three litres of water yesterday uh, and I was walking up and down the corridors uh, within about two hours of coming around from the operation so yeah it's fine I'm, I'm not in a lot of pain or discomfort uh, but I am very hungry because because I haven't eaten anything now for 36 hours I'm on, on clear fluids to drink although um, Connie Connie Russell's just put me on to uh, some free fluids so I can drink whatever I like but uh, generally I do pretty well I'm feeling good and uh, do you know what this morning at half past eight I had the first little puff of air come out of my backside first time in a year so that's good it's a good sign but I'm waiting obviously till the food comes into my mouth to see what happens the other end but at the moment it feels like I've got reasonable control there so I hope that carries on um, that's it, I thought I'd do a little update and I, I, you're not supposed to film in the hospital so I'm making sure I'm not getting anyone in uh, the picture and I'm in a quiet little corridor and I did a little bit of a video when I came round from the operation just like I did last time without the bag so yes, I'm a Dyson, I'm bagless once again, feels good and thank you to Michael Michael, my friend in the Alan Cummings Day Centre who's another patient in the bed next to me Joe Michael has actually uh, got mentioned at the Queen's Diamond Jubilee um, celebrated on the BBC because he's a, a security guard at the Global Academy in Southwark and his pupils liked him so much that they gave him a special mention. Isn't that lovely? He was a lovely man and uh, it was nice to pass the time chatting to him. And the staff there were, were really lovely. I would have quite been quite happy to stay there. Anyway. I'll give you an update when I've got something more to say, but at the moment I'm doing fine. I'm not going to uh, enable comments. There's no need, is there? There's going to be plenty of time for commenting when the toilet fun begins. Take care. Bye-bye.